All right, so this is reholing my formictopus canceritis, or otherwise known as um, the Haitian brown, who I have named Scrapper. All right, as you can see here, one of the best things to do is to get a home slightly larger than the last home. That way, it's easier to get them into their new home. And you'll see why in just a second. Here, I'll move this a little bit. So you can see, here's Scrapper. She's uh, not of the happiest kind. Uh, yeah, you just saw that. <laughs> probably because maybe she's also hungry um haitian browns oh oh kicking some hairs i don't know if you guys caught that it's kind of hard to see her um especially with her being as dark as she is hold on let me uh try zooming in Now, just in case some of you get a little, oh, why are you prodding her with a stick? It's not a stick, it is a paintbrush. Come on. You're almost there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're almost there. Come on, baby girl. There you go. There you go. All right. And that's basically how you do it. That's, uh, well, basically the best way to do it. As you can see, she's going to now start to explore her new home. She's going to notice that there's a little more space. Um, I don't know if, yeah, well, it looks like smoke. She actually, uh, basically silked her way from her old home into her new home. Um, but other than that, yeah, that's, that's basically how you do it.